Welcome to the unofficial Decaying Winter Combat Guide. I'm your instructor, Commander Scorpion, and I'm here to whip you lot into shape. Let's get to the basics of combat. But first, the types of perks. First, we have the Frontliners which includes Arbiters, Executioners, Drifters, Apostles, Vagabonds, Lazarus, Berserkers and Immolators. All of them are considered Frontline. The Arbiter has an increased melee damage bonus and knuckle boom attachment, while the Executioner has resistance to damage and bounty goggles, Drifters have immunity to cripple and can go invisible, Apostles regenerate health when fighting with melee, summoning Shadow Hunters to fight, Vagabonds have their high damage sword, Lazarus has its ability to prevent death, Berserkers have their serum, and Immolators have their flames. These frontlines specialize in melee combat, but not with guns. Backliners are those who specialize in firearms, summoning, or general support. These include the Risk Runner, Zealot, Tick Spider, Blitzer, Artillerist, Prophet, and Sovereign. The Risk Runner excels in hip fire accuracy and is armed with a minigun to shred through crowds of enemies. The Zealot possesses a shield that can deflect attacks. The Tick Spider may send off explosive Tick Spiders that detonate when they come into touch with enemies. Blitzers may use explosives to kill and stun foes from a distance. Artillerists are firearms specialists who provide firing support. Prophets provide the squad with information on loot locations and enemy positions. Sovereigns specialize in power in numbers, weak summons that spawn from enemy corpses. Now we have the support, the backbone of the team with no weapon preferences. These include the hive mind, the crosslink and mind flayer. The hive mind specializes in crowd control, slowing enemies with its legion of insects. Crosslinks specialize in binding groups of enemies, and the mind flayer you can convert enemies into allies to fight. Frontliners fight on the front lines with melee, backliners support them with guns and their abilities, and support helps with crowds making frontline life a bit easier. Priority perks are not new perks, but they are for frontliners who require kills. Executioners who use goggles gain power with each kill, if he obtains all the kills, they will be able to one-shot enemies. Apostles are a priority perk as well, but they just require kills to heal and nothing else. Vagabonds earn dog tags for each kill with the sword, boosting their mobility speed with each kill. You can have up to 10 dog tags worth of speed, one dog tag increases speed by 1%, which caps at 10% for 10 tags. The circus 2 require kills, their ability requires enemies to be killed in order for their ability to be maintained before it expires. Let these guys get the kills, only pitch in if there are too many enemies. 